What's going on ladies and gents, Dalibor here for T3G and today we're reviewing the Atomi Sound Hub. All right, folks, let's get right into it here. This is, I wanna, I wanna issue a caveat here. I bought this before Christmas, right? A friend of ours hooked us up with access to Sam's Club. They let us borrow their card, essentially. We went through and I'm like, hey, I'm here, might as well take advantage. I picked up some SD cards and I picked up a Bluetooth speaker. I know I have like four or five of them around the house, but it's kind of one of those things where I don't wanna have to go get it. I would like to have a Bluetooth speaker in every room because that way I'm ready and I can just connect to whatever I want to connect to. Now the added bonus of this particular Bluetooth speaker is A, it was 25 bucks at Sam's Club, really nice price for the features, right? It comes with this base. Now this base is pretty sweet because it's got charging options. It's got multiple charging options. Now the power cable that it has is very thick. It's a very strong, sturdy cable. Uh, so that means it's a shielded insulated cable, which is excellent. On the back, it's got two standard AC outlets, which is outstanding. They're separated, so if you have brick-type connectors, you should have no problem connecting. And then on the other four sides, we've got USB. Two USBs are 2.1 amp for charging more powerful devices. Two of them are one amp. And then in the middle here, we've got the actual charger for the Bluetooth speaker. It pops right in. It's got this really cool look and has plenty of spots for you to grab the, the actual Bluetooth speaker to remove it. It comes right off real easy, no problem. Now, as far as the Bluetooth speaker itself, it is actually pretty nice. It's lightweight. I would almost say that you could pocket this if it weren't for the like rubbery back. I feel like that would get caught in your jeans or something like that. But otherwise, it's got this rubbery back so that it doesn't slide around. However, it's powerful enough that it will actually bounce around when it's playing. On two of the sides, you've got controls, including power, play, pause, and volume up and down. And that's actually it for any of the buttons or anything like that. There are no vent ports, so the bass is not quite as deep and rich as I would like, but otherwise, it's still a pretty powerful hit for this little thing. I mean, realistically, this is like an inch, inch and a half uh, driver, and it's not a not very large but it's still powerful as far as the outside the top and immediate bottom areas are this like shiny polish and it really collects fingerprints now when you power it on it actually lights up the controls so you can see them see where they are at night which is I think really nice and it's got some really nice audible cues Bluetooth is on. okay let's play your music so once it's connected it tells you that it's ready to go which is nice because then you don't have to look at your phone if you're not sure. And when you turn it off, it's also a very nice audible cue. Sound up, signing off. All right, it's connected to my phone, so let's give it a quick listen. All right, the phone is all the way up. to the table, I feel like you guys uh, are getting a lot of the bass here. So, so that's very nice. Uh, when you turn up the volume all the way, it does blink the light, so that's when you know it's all the way up. And uh, like I said, it's, it's very powerful for the size. Now, the biggest thing that I wanna talk about with this speaker is the battery life. I have never charged this speaker. It's July, so it was charged, let's say it was a brand new, freshly packaged product in November. So charged out of the factory, and the standby time is eight months or more, because I mean, realistically, it's I've been using it for about a week. I played it for about two hours outside on full blast. I've used it at least three other times since then. Again, full blast. I've had no battery drop off, no volume drop off. So I don't even know how long potentially this battery could last in standby. Now, the actual box and the, the base itself, surprisingly enough, says that the battery life is up to four hours, which I think is probably accurate. I think if I was straight playing it, four hours is probably the max you'll get. It says the range is up to 10 meters for the Bluetooth and the driver is 2.1 EDR. I don't know what that means here.
So overall, I think this is an outstanding product, especially for 25 bucks. I mean, I think you get a lot of value out of this. You get the charging, you get the even AC charging, plus you get a portable Bluetooth speaker. Very few Bluetooth speakers are gonna give you all of that. I know there's lots of Bluetooth speakers that have the speaker itself that's removable and you can take it with you, but they don't have six charging ports. So I think overall, this is an outstanding value for your dollars. So if this is available on Amazon, we will link it down below. If uh, you have a friend or if you have a Sam's Club access, uh, I would definitely say pick this up if it's still available. Like I said, I bought it eight months ago. I don't even know if it's still at the store, but this is an absolute buy recommendation. I, I, I couldn't possibly recommend this more. This is outstanding. The only downside, like I said, is this thing's really, really heavy on fingerprinting. I mean, but everyone's got microfiber, right? And look at that polished brand new so that's it folks i don't want to keep gushing about this it's definitely a recommended buy uh, as i said if it's on amazon i will link it down below if you guys like this video make sure you hit that like button if you didn't like it there is no dislike button but definitely make sure to subscribe for tech reviews tips gaming footage film all sorts of stuff that we do here on t3g thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next one